Hello and welcome to Cooking with Mang General. Today I'm going to show you how to make how special chicken. And um, this chicken is the uh, chicken um, breath, or you may use any part of the um, chickens. Okay, so the amount is one pound. You want to um, cut into small pieces just like this. Okay, once again, one pound and fry, I mean flour, any um, fried chicken um, flour will work, okay? And uh, you need tapioca starch. Um, I pre-mixed this already, so what I did is um, I used half and half. So for example, if you need uh, half a cup of fried chicken flour, you, need, you also need half a cup of tapioca starch. Okay, depend on um, how much um, chicken you have. Okay, so once again, half fried chicken flour and half um, tapioca starch. You need three eggs. You need some onion, some colorful uh, bell pepper, or you may use only one color. Okay, um, some green onion and three tablespoons of garlics. You want to dice the garlics. And with the garlics, the more you use, the better. You know, I don't know if you like a lot of garlic or not, but like I said, the more the better. And also you need um, oil, okay? And I have three color here, bell pepper, yellow, I mean orange, red, and green, as you can see here. Okay, so there's no amount. Okay, if you want to put a lot, you may put a lot black pepper it is one tablespoon excuse me one teaspoon okay you want grind and um, salt half a teaspoon sweet chili sauce okay you want three tablespoon and this is the uh, measuring tablespoon I'm using okay once again three tablespoon um, sweet chili sauce this is not spicy at all Okay, so children can eat it too. Oyster sauce, you need two tablespoons. And here's the tablespoons, okay? So um, next, um, I'm gonna show, how, show you how to mix the uh, flour with the um, grind pepper and the salt, okay? Once you mix the uh, flour into equal ratio, go ahead and pour salt and uh, ground pepper in and stir it well. After you mix your flour, go ahead and um, beat your eggs, whip your eggs. After you beat the eggs and have the uh, flour ready and um, start preparing for the um, deep fry. So what you want to do is right, you want to pick up some uh, chicken pieces and drop it in the eggs, wash it, pick it up and then wash it in the flour. Okay, just watch me. Um, you may use gloves or wash your hand if you don't want to use gloves. Okay. After you um, put it in the flour and go ahead and start um, picking the chicken pieces one by one and wash it with the flour and then you set it aside okay just like this next okay what you want to do is so you want to heat up your oil to a medium heat okay and then start deep frying your chicken until golden brown or crispy.
like this process, the ones you put all the chicken pieces in, do not, okay, do not stir it. Okay, if you stir it, the um, flour is gonna break out, okay, remember that. Wait until two to three minutes and then you can slowly start stirring it, okay? Once your um, chicken is done, okay, repeat the process until you finish all your chicken, okay? Chicken or crispy and golden brown, go ahead and removed. And I'm going to show you what to do next. Next, what you want to do is that you want to remove all the oil from the wax and use some of the flavor oil you deep fry and start um, um, roasting the um, garlic until golden brown. Okay, just watch me how I do it. Next, you need to, uh, um, excuse me, next you want to add the uh, oyster sauce and uh, sweet chili sauce in it. After you mix it well, go ahead and put in your chicken and stir it and then turn off the heat. Stir it for one minute. important at this time you want to taste it and adjust the flavor to your taste okay if you need more um, uh, sweet you add more um, sweet uh, chili paste if you need a little bit more salty you add um, more um, oyster sauce okay Okay, um, there's not uh, much to it. Here is the special, uh, I mean, excuse me, house special chicken. It looks beautiful and it smells so good. Okay, so um, before I taste, just want to say thank you so much um, for your support, for your like, for your subscribe. And also, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so. Okay, so you can follow the, for more amazing foods and dessert. Thank you so much. Wow. Very colorful. Mm. Tastes so good in the mouth. I mean, the sweetness, the uh, saltiness, even the combination of the two is amazing. Okay. So, also, the chicken is very crunchy too. Okay. Mm.